doctors under the Kenya Medical Practitioners, Pharmacists and Dentists Union, KMPDU, and Health Cabinet Secretary Susan Nakumecha have locked horns over the placement of 1,200 medical interns. KPMDU formally issued a seven-day strike notice for withdrawal of services by medical practitioners, pharmacists, and dentists in all institutions under the Ministry of Health and county governments throughout the Republic. As Health CS maintained that there was no money to facilitate medical interns. Our very own Seth Alale with the latest standoff over remuneration between medics and the Ministry of Health. Solidarity forever. A health crisis in major hospitals under the Ministry of Health and county governments looms next week from Wednesday midnight after the expiry of a seven-day strike notice for withdrawal of services by medical practitioners, pharmacists and dentists under the Kenya Medical Practitioners Pharmacist and Dentist Union in all institutions. There will be no single medical doctor in any hospital where KMPDU has a membership. The medics accused the national government and county governments of failing to honor a collective bargaining agreement and court orders, as well as failing to place medical interns. They assert that the planned industrial action will not be called off unless all the demands are addressed. The ministry said the same thing, that their hands are tied. So we hope that this notice will untie their hands. But in a quick rejoinder, Health Cabinet Secretary Susan Nakumicha dismissed the doctor's demands as being unrealistic, reiterating that the ministry's hands are tied on the issue of intense placement. For now, that is unsustainable. As a ministry, we do not have resources to post them. And the law does not allow us as a ministry to post when we do not have budget for it. For the union makes us strong. Apart from KMPDU, other health unions, among them Kenya Union of Clinical Officers, Kenya Union of Nutritionists and Dietitians, Kenya Union of National Laboratories Officers, and Kenya Union of Pharmaceutical Technologies have also issued countrywide notices to relevant ministries, state departments, and the Council of Governors. They want their demands fully met. Seth Olale, Citizen TV.